Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. From today onwards, let's dig into Blender. Absolute basic. To start, of course, you need Blender. Blender can be downloaded easily from Blender.org. Click on download. So this is what Blender UI looks like. Just click anywhere to remove this option. This area is called 3D viewport and all the crazy things happens here. By default, uh, we have a cube, a camera and the light source. On the top, we can see different menus. Modeling, sculpting, UV editing, testing, shading, animation, rendering, composite, human box, scripting. We will dig into all that later. On the right side, this option is called Outliner. Then all the things that we add. All the things that we add in viewport will appear in the Outliner. Below the Outliner, we have properties such as scene properties, render engines, world properties, physics particles, materials, texturing, everything is included here. We will dig on to that later. Actually, this UI is really easy if we are not making it complicated. And the very cool thing is we can customize this viewport on whatever way we want. If we come on this edge, then right click and click on vertical split. Press here. I think we have an another 3D viewport. And we can change this into shade and editor or compositor or image editor, UV editor, any way you want. So we will look into that detail in later. As this is the first day, I don't want to make it complicated. Uh, this 3D report, actually this is 3D, we can click on middle pause and rotate and see in every perspective. This is 3D perspective. This red line shows x-axis, y line shows, sorry, green line shows y-axis and there is z-axis which is blue line, I think this is not shown here. We want to, we want to select and enable it. Now let's try to move, rotate and scan the cube. To move the cube, simply click here. This is move or press G in the keyboard. <coughs> there will be pivot appears in the center of the skew. Simply press blue line for the Z axis, red for X axis and green for Y axis. Simple as that. This is this here button, it's called rotate. Simply rotate in green axis, red axis and blue axis. Shortcut for rotation is R. Now we have to scale. Simply press X, S on this keyboard to scale. We can scale like this in X axis or in Z axis or in green, which is Y axis. So these are the basic navigations that we will use in Blender. 